How's it going, folks? CR here, and I was watching a video on Sargon of Akkad's channel's uh, thinkery titled Britain to Ban Sharp Objects, and I'll post the link in the description. I got about three minutes in, and that's all I've gotten into the video so far. I decided I needed to chime in my two cents. Guys, this is something those of us in the Second Amendment community chime in on. This is one of the things we keep on warning people about. It is the people who have this mentality that anything that can be used as a weapon should be prohibited, if, you know, restricted, if not outright banned, to keep people safe. Well, that mentality never stops. It's not going to stop with firearms, and it's not going to stop with knives, too. And I know here, in places like Texas, it's really far-fetched to think that, you know, we'd be prohibited from owning or carrying, you know, knives like this one I use and carry every day. You know, I use it on my job daily. Um, I know here, right now, it seems pretty far-fetched that these will be prohibited, but give the gun controllers and, you know, well, everyone with that mentality of, of we can just bubble wrap the world enough slack and eventually that reality could become a possibility for us too. And if anyone can get this video over to Sargon, I mean, the one thing I'd like to say to you, dude, is the way you see it with that potential knife ban right now is exactly how I see it when gun controllers here talk about banning the AR-15s. Um, <laughs> you know, so, I mean, now I think you kind of understand how most of us see more gun control ads. I mean, you shouldn't be so surprised, though, that this is happening in your country now, and just like you shouldn't be surprised at the speech codes. You guys have taken that mentality and pretty much let that mentality go to most of the people in your country. The vast majority of Brits seem to think that restricting freedoms like that just solely on the grounds of, well, public safety of some sort is a viable excuse and when you do that eventually you do get things like proposed bans on sharp objects speech codes i mean the idea that you guys simply just ban these things right after done blaine in an emotional response i mean yeah i mean it's the same mentality uh that those judges are taking with the sharp objects right now. To a different degree, yes, to a much more extreme degree, but it's still the same mentality. So, again guys, I mean, this is one of the many reasons why we should start opposing, if we don't already oppose, these weapons laws. And quite frankly, I think we need to roll back the clock on some of these restrictions as is. One of the things that needs to go is the 1986 ban on machine guns. It'd be nice to see some of the NFA restrictions go too. It would be nice to see national concealed carry reciprocity at least get recognized. Who cares how much these gun controllers scream and squeal about this? At the end of the day, we keep on letting them get their way. We keep on giving in to them. That's eventually what we're going to end up with. And I think it's time to push back because if we don't, they're going to keep taking and taking and taking. Thank you all for watching. Y'all take her easy out there. Have a great day.